Hi, it's Janie. Welcome back to my channel. And today I will be doing another review of a product that I received from Octoly. And you've heard me talk about Octoly, but if you are not familiar with it, it is a, a, um, a go-between between creators and brands. And it's just a an outlet where creators can get in contact with brands to be able to get products to review, to try out and review. And um, one of the products, I have several that are getting ready to come up that I received from Octoly. And the first one that I'm going to be doing in this series is from By Terry, which is a very, very um, luxury brand. Um, it's sold at Nordstrom, um, Space and K, Beautylish, um, Neiman Marcus, those type places. And what I have that I'm going to be reviewing for you today is a lip balm. And here is the box right here. It's the By Terry um, Balm de Rose. Balm de Rose. And it is just a lip balm. Here's the box. And here's the actual product right here. It's very luxury and just very um, girly and high-end as far as the packaging goes. You have a gold lid with a frosted glass container and the size on it is um, 10 grams or 0.35 ounces is the net weight um, looks like that there and then it is a screw on lid and then here is the product here um, I've been using this for about a week now and I will tell you that it is very moisturizing and it just takes a little bit. It doesn't take much at all. I do have it on my lips. I don't know if you can see a little bit of a shine. Um, to me, it does not put any kind of tint on your lips. So it's not a <clears throat> it's not a tinted lip balm. And <clears throat> in my opinion, it's more than just a, a balm. It's actually more like a, a treatment type product. So I've been using mine. Um, a little bit at night as my overnight balm and then a little bit in the morning as just my moisturizer that I put on my lips in the morning time. It does have the smell of rose in it because it does have rose oil in it and so if you don't like oil, um, rose you you won't care for this product. I personally love the smell of roses and I personally love the benefit that rose oil um, the skincare benefits that you get from rose oil. So I don't mind the rose at all. I quite enjoy it. I think it's very moisturizing. Um, the price is, it is, like I said, a very luxury, high-end brand. So the price is more than what you probably would normally pay for a balm. But it's not a balm that you're just going to throw in your purse and just, you know, take it in and out all the time and use it throughout the day like you would say one of your EOS lip balms. This is one that you're going to use at night as a skincare treatment for your lips. Um, it does run $60, but I really think that as little product as it takes for to do the lips and you don't have to keep reapplying it because you put it on right before you go to bed and you wake up the next morning and your lips are still moisturized. And um, I think this little pot would last a year. Now, I don't know for sure because this is the first time I've ever had it. But from just the little amount that I've had to use and the amount that's in here, I think I'm definitely going to be able to use this for a good year, um, nine months, nine months to a year. So if you um, think of it that way and do it cost per month is pretty affordable when you're looking at it that way. And plus you are getting a lot of good um, beneficial beneficial skincare ingredients in the balm. I'm going to put my glasses on so I can read off the box what is in here. <clears throat> um, it has essential rose wax, um, floral oils, and hydrating, anti-aging, and smoothing bio ceramides. Ceramides and it is um, anti free radical and protective UV filters. So, definitely a good balm to, to use at night and also of the morning time. So, I do recommend it. I know it's pricey, but this would also make a really nice gift. 
um, say your mother-in-law is not into makeup but she does skincare and maybe she doesn't want to wear you know a tint on her lips but would like something you know that's still luxury and um, very feminine and nice maybe you can think about doing something like this and um, like I said you can get it from Nordstrom, Beautylish, Neiman Marcus and if you've never shopped with Beautylish um, they have wonderful customer service and they have really really quick shipping so you can maybe check out this product on Beautylish anyway so that is it for my review of the by Terry, um, let's see, what is it called? The Balm de Rose. I keep wanting to say it. I'm going to keep wanting to call it the Rose Balm. Balm de Rose. Love it. I think it's very, very nice. Pricey, but yes, I think it's worth every penny. So thank you so much for sh uh, shopping with me. Anyway, thank you so much for joining me today on my channel. And um, make sure you do a thumbs up and subscribe so you don't miss the other upcoming reviews that I'll be doing here pretty soon on this channel. Bye.